Hi, my name is Madhuri Ali Akbar. I'm Dominic Dark. Hi, my name is Erica Liu. I'm the developer of Banana Pie. And I am the developer of the game Colonialis, Jamestown. And I'm the developer of Spirit to Evolve 2. We are the developers of Flash Trash. What inspired me to come into this competition was actually my computer science teacher. A teacher in my school recommended that I go to this competition, thus I entered Code Games Challenge. The XPRIZE goal with Code Games, a global game making challenge, was definitely to democratize access to learning through technology and to really empower the next generation of innovators to follow their dreams and their interests. But also we wanted to build up our previous learning prizes and we wanted to create ways for the next generation to learn coding and game design skills while creating the future of their dreams. Outside of making games and playing games, I also like to draw and paint, so just anything art related. Some of my favorite hobbies are reading, drawing, bike riding, and playing Ultimate Frisbee. Our other hobbies include horse riding, baking, playing the drums and the piano, and dancing. I've been writing for a long time, even before I really started actually playing video games. Outside of games and game making, I enjoy making beats and I have the equipment to do so in my spare time. I was so impressed that such a great number of students from not just um, one country, but so many countries were represented in this challenge. We set out to have the competition be international from the very beginning as it was conceived, and we were very excited to see that we were successful in that regard. We had entrants from over 70 different countries around the world. I'm from Dunedin, New Zealand. I'm from Karachi, Pakistan. I live in Jamaica. And I live in Amor, Canada. I think it is amazing that gaming can be a language that people can speak and can get to know each other over. And it doesn't require, you know, being able to do something super well. It just requires some curiosity and some excitement. I started learning Scratch in sixth grade and I've improved a lot since then by looking at tutorials made by other Scratchers and by making my own games and getting feedback from the community. Karachi, my city, the city of light, is Pakistan's premier financial and industrial center. But unfortunately, it has a very poor garbage management system. So my game had to revolve around minimum waste production. In my game, I really tried to incorporate a deeper message about what our human nature will result in in the future. Our mission is to encourage and teach people to separate and recycle trash to decrease the pollution of our planet. One of the most impressive things for me when I get to play the games that our entrants make is seeing truly awesome games and then getting to talk to the young person who's created them and finding out that it's actually the first time they've even tried making a video game, maybe even the first time they've tried programming. Gaming is the future. Gaming is the present and it's a part of our lives. Gaming really can become a soundtrack and a really big beacon and pinnacle of this generation right now, especially during a time of being socially distanced. So I'm really excited about being on the cusp of breakthrough and how we entertain ourselves, how we train ourselves for careers of the future, because gaming is a unifier of the people and gaming is here to stay.